wires overheard all over our area help us bring electricity and cable and internet signals as well to our homes. Yeah, they need to eventually bury all those. Uh, all modern conveniences, but one Houston couple called Amy Davis when the cable company created an eyesore. They asked Amy for help. She came through because that's what she does. Yeah, oh, thanks. Good well, morning. this was an interesting situation. Yeah, Good yeah. morning. So they had tried to call the cable company themselves mm -hmm. for six months, Oy. far too long. They had no luck. So then they finally called me when they couldn't take the view from their balcony anymore. Take a look. This outdoor space is what sold Vasily Magazines and his wife on their Heights home 14 years ago. I have my morning coffee out here. I mean, this is really our favorite spot of the house. But last fall, when they came back from vacation, they spotted an addition to their second story patio. It was right there. Or at least an addition very close to it. I mean, it's, it's less than uh, 43 inches. A wire stretching almost across the corner of their balcony. They've tried to camouflage it with a plant, but they're tired of staring at it every time they come outside. Well, I mean, it's a nice shot. When magazines learned AT&T ran the wire when his neighbor signed up for their cable service, he tried repeatedly to contact the company himself. But most of the time the calls went to recordings. A lot of times they ask for account numbers and such, which I don't have because I'm not their client. He doesn't want to interfere with his neighbor's cable, but thinks this could be an easy fix. I feel that they can raise the cable up higher, and then, you know, then it wouldn't be as much of a problem. And AT&T agreed. We made one phone call, and the company had a crew out the very next day moving this cable. Magazines took these pictures. So sometimes half the battle is getting through to the right person, right? Because these companies are so large. We have a good resource for you. If you're ever having a problem with your cable, gas, or power company, any company that uses the city's right of way for their equipment, you can contact your city government. In this case, it's the Houston Department of Administration and Regulatory Affairs. So employees in that department have liaisons with these companies. They can help you get through to the right people. We've put a link to that agency on click2houston.com right there in the consumer section. Yeah. Yeah, what you know and who you know. Exactly. Exactly. For there are sure. a lot of other issues too. I mean, basically, if that was even an easement because it was so close. Yeah. Right. You know, so they moved it to a different pole and raised it. All Thank right. goodness. Amy got it done like that. <laughs> Good work. <laughs> and now we all know who to call in the future. Yeah. Excellent. Exactly. Thanks. Direct line. Thanks, Amy. <laughs> well, they're working to avoid.